Okay, here we are guys. Um, as you can see, there's red in front of me. I'm just gonna quickly show you my team that I'm rocking right now. Um, I have, you can see there's a big level discrepancy between this Pikachu here uh, and the rest of my team. Um, I essentially needed this Pikachu um, because it's a flash uh, user. You do need flash in order to get through Mount Silver to face red unless you just are able to memorize the layout of uh, the, the 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 mountain um, I, I don't have the patience for that um, so I had to bring in an outside Pokemon uh, to use flash which was this Pikachu but I'll show you the rest of my team I have rock Lynch, my Tyranitar um, if you are able to save up the money to purchase um, coins to buy the Larvitar in the Celadon game corner, do it, um, because you'll get a level 40 level tar, or Larvitar, uh, not Larvitar, is it Larvitar? Yeah, Larvitar, as opposed to a level 15 or 20 Larvitar that you might encounter uh, in Mount Silver. Um, so I highly recommend it, that's what I did, and that's what allowed me to get a Tyranitar on my team, which is solid. But I also have um, Gengar, and then I have Skarmory, which I'm probably only going to use against Red's Venusaur. Um, I have a Lapras, um, but my Lapras also knows, as you can see, it knows Psychic, Thunderbolt, Ice Beam, so it's got a lot of coverage. Um, and then it's also just got in a really, really decent special defense and even just normal defense. Um, and uh, solid special attack, and then uh, Snorlax. Snorlax is sort of just my my wild card. If I need uh, like a damage sponge, I'll throw Snorlax in. All right, um, I'm starting with Rackalanch just because uh, I, I keep wanting to say Ash. Red's first Pokemon is going to be is Pikachu, um, so I will put it out of its misery with uh, earthquake um so yeah we'll see how this goes again this is this is a, a, a forfeit run but i still want to finish the game let's do it okay doesn't say a thing Let's go. I'll turn this up just just a little bit. There you go. Yeah. All right. So let's lead with earthquake. So, because I'm rock dark, this will actually hit, but doesn't hit for a lot. One shot. Beautiful. There we are. Here we go. Okay. Throwing out the big guns. I am going to do the same. Switch out to Starscream. Let's go. Solar beam. Love it. I'm going to counter with fly. You're going to completely miss and hopefully not use sunny day. Hopefully I'll attack before you use, get a chance to use sunny day. Will I one shot you though? Come on. Shit. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to counter with I'm going to counter with resting. Now I know Venusaur has synthesis, so and it can also just 
do solar beams with no wind up. Um, but this is still going to waste at least two turns. I could potentially do two rests. Oh. Or one rest, I guess. Okay. Yep, it's going to heal. It's going to heal it for a lot. Hopefully not full health. Yep. Okay, this is good. This is eating through the sunny day. The solar beam, this is fine. This is totally fine. See, even if it does a critical hit, it's not very effective. Sunlight faded. This could be bad. This could be bad. Ah, uh, shit. Okay. Okay. Well, we'll 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 deal with it. It's 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 fine. It's fine. It's not like I'm gonna be using. Um, Skarmory against his Charizard. This is fine. Charizard, yep, okay. So we are going to switch out Charizard with... With Lapras. Yeah, this might do a bit. Yeah, yep, that does a that does a nice chunk of damage. Um, I think I'm going to, yeah, I think I'm going to wait out the sunny day. Um, so yeah, I'm going to use this just to wait it out. Um, cause yeah, if this flamethrower crits me, then I'm, I'm done. And I could be wrong, but I feel like Sunny Day also decreases the power of water attacks. So I am going to wait this one out. Fantastic. Sunlight faded. Beautiful. Okay. Now let's counter with Surf. Charizard, buddy, that's that's a that's a wasted turn right there, dude. Again, will this be a one shot though? Yes. Okay. That was a slow one shot, but a one shot it was. And out, Espeon. Okay. So for this, I could technically toss out Gengar, but Espeon Psychic would probably one-shot Gengar, so I'm actually going to send Rockalanche back out, because it's part dark. <laughs> Fantastic, okay. Yep. It does have Mud Slap, which is not great, but I have Crunch. Crunch. Stab Crunch, too. Really? Really? That's just mean. Um, I'm going to crunch it out. Oh, I'm surprised. I'm surprised he doesn't get healed. Come on. Yeah, bastard. Oh, you bastard. 
in Xavier in the end, though. Okay. Blastoise. I'm actually going to send Lapras back out. Rain Dance is fantastic in this case because, um, granted, I have Thunderbolt, but if I had Thunder um, on my Lapras, I, it would be a guaranteed hit um, with Rain Dance. Um, but still, we're going to see how Thunderbolt does. May not one shot. Yeah, I didn't think it would. Blastoise is pretty beefy. Again, like, there's first there's Fire Spin and now Whirlpool. Like, this, this is a wasted move. Okay. This is, yep, this is in the bag. There we go. Okay, so for Snorlax, this one should, in theory, be easy. I could essentially just use Snorlax and just have a Snorlax off. But I'm actually going to switch in Gengar because none of Snorlax's attacks will hit Gengar. So Snorlax can use Amnesia to his heart's content. Um, I'm just going to keep using, oh, uh, it's a two-way street. Sorry, that's my bad, which is not great because it allowed Snorlax to essentially get two free amnesias in. Um, this may not be good, but I'm just going to start throwing out Thunderbolts. Oh, okay. I may have to reassess on this one. Um... I'm just, yeah, I think I actually am going to do Snorlax versus Snorlax. That's hilarious. It went to sleep for for that that small amount of health lost. Okay. Um, let's try return. Wow, that's the same animation as Body Slam. That's hilarious. Yeah, Leftovers is so overpowered in this game. Uh, let's try Body Slam. Damn. I wonder if Red will heal his Snorlax. Um, I'm going to do another return. Yeah, I'm just going to do two returns and hopefully that will do it. made me flinch the bastard I completely blanked on the fact that snore makes you flinch do we have this is it in the bag come on come on come on come on come on come on 
There you go. There we go. There you have it. That is Pokemon Trainer Red. Defeated. That is it. There you go. That's it, Pokemon Crystal, guys. Again, um, I don't, I don't count this as a win because I had to use the glitch essentially to be around the same level. Um, yeah, but well, there you go, there you have it. Game is done. Gonna save that. 125-ish levels, because it still took quite a few levels to do the glitch. Um, yeah. Don't, um, don't play Gold, Silver, or Crystal as a Nuzlocke. Just, just, just don't do it. There, there are better versions of Johto um, to play. Namely, boom, boom, boom. Give me two seconds. Hard cold, right there. Okay, guys, that's it for this video. Um, well, I'll see you in the next one. Ciao for now.